Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about forgiving the narcissist and moving on. Now a lot of people feel like if they forgive the narcissist then they are weak or maybe they feel like if they forgive the narcissist that they are forgetting what's going on. You have to forgive but never forget. You forgiving the narcissist is setting you free, allowing you to move on emotionally, mentally, allowing you to just not so much forget the past but allowing you to understand the past allowing you to understand what happened and not make the mistake allowing you to grow into a better version of yourself forgiving the narcissist is very hard it's been very hard for me i cannot lie to you because i feel like it's, it's very tough to forgive somebody especially when they haven't haven't said sorry they haven't apologized very very difficult especially when they feel like you're in the wrong and they feel like that they haven't done anything wrong it's very very tough to forgive i have i have forgiven all the narcissists in my life but i will never forget i will never forget before if i saw them i would just be you know i would become somebody that i'm not and what I mean by that is I'll be angry, I'll be bitter, I'll be keep talking about the past, keep bringing it up, keep bringing up the new supply. So you become very toxic when you do that. I don't talk about the new supply, I don't talk about the past. I'm co-parenting with one narcissist, allowing this narcissist to be a part of my son's life. The only difference is, even though I have forgiven the narcissist, I still have my boundaries. My boundaries are still pretty much the same. So I allow uh, the narcissist to contact his child allow him to talk to his child what i won't allow is you know him crossing the boundaries for example asking what we're doing you know if it's not about his relationship with my son then i stop the conversation or i say look what is it that you're looking for what is it that you want if you want to talk to our son it has to be strictly about my son what he's doing what he's up to what he likes you know it should never be about me I shouldn't even be in the equation or in the conversation. I won't forget, but it, it doesn't it doesn't affect me how it used to. So yeah, I know he I know the ex narcissist cheated, I know the ex narcissist stole, I know they manipulated, I know they did all these things, but it's it's not dwelling in my heart, it's not constantly in my mind. And that's because I've decided to focus on me, focus on my son, focus on, on raising my son to the best of my ability, focusing on as they say, glowing up, looking better, feeling better, eating healthier, having healthier relationships, whether that's romantic, whether that's friendships, and just improving as a person. Forgiving doesn't mean forgetting. Forgiving is freeing yourself. We're not going to forget what happened, but we're not going to dwell on it either. Thank you for listening to my video. And um, if you haven't already, please hit that like button and please subscribe. And I will see you for the next video. Bye.